Okay, so today I'm gonna show you guys how to get into the BIO settings on Windows 10. I'm using an HP laptop. Most of the people wanna want to diagnose the Wi-Fi card or the Wi-Fi Bluetooth adapter, wireless Bluetooth adapter, or just to you know check and diagnose what's going on with the computer. But some people they will just wanna check the adapters. For example, disabling or disabling the adapters. Uh, if you have a Wi-Fi icon here with an X, this might help you to diagnose what's going on. All right. So before going into Windows BIOS settings on Windows 10, you need to make sure go to settings and go to network and internet and then go to change adapter options right here you can see the Wi-Fi adapter that is installed inside the computer same as the Ethernet that is installed on the computer some people have issues with the Wi-Fi card the Wi-Fi adapter uh, just need to make sure you see this this indicates that the Wi-Fi adapter is indeed installed inside the computer inside the computer from here you can go to you can right click on the adapter you can disable it connect disconnect diagnose properties you can check any important information but let's say this here is disabled and you cannot enable it from here then you check in the BIOS settings. Uh, this is how we do it. This is a Windows 10 HP laptop. So you go start and restart it. Restart the computer. Wait for it to restart. And when it's booting, you're gonna press F10 many times. Alright, F10 when it reboots, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, keep counting until you get this menu. If you get here, just click cancel and you get the BIOS settings menu. Then you need to go here where it says system config and then you go to built in device options. As you can see, we have all the modules, all the adapters here. So make sure they are all checked and make sure wake online is checked and boot to network if none of this is checked check them and you should be good to go again be careful making any changes here you gotta know what you're doing otherwise you're gonna you're gonna have uh, issues because right here it's really really delicate you can change make some changes a lot of changes to the computer and sometimes might not work properly just make sure you know what you're doing but this is how you get into bio settings on windows 10 thank you